my name, come up, respect me. Yo, stop playing with my name. I'll drill y'all. Stop playing with my name. I ain't gonna say it no more. What's going on, guys? Beastly Gamer here. Welcome to the channel. Today I'll be unboxing my Sony Gold wireless headset, the Uncharted 4 A Thief's End Edition. Now, I recently picked this up. I bought it last night uh, because my Turtle Beach Stealth 400s actually broke on me. Now, that's my second pair of Turtle Beach Stealth 400s that actually snapped right where the, uh, the earbud is. It's really cheap plastic and it ended up cracking. I had to use some, uh, some scotch tape or duct tape to kind of hold it together for like the last week. And so I said, screw that. Let me go get me a new headset, a different brand, and hopefully one that'll last a little bit longer. So I went and got the gold wireless stereo headset, uh, the Uncharted 4 Thieves End Edition, and I haven't done an unboxing in a while. These uh, headphones are $100 at GameStop. Uh, and so I figured I'd go ahead and unbox them here for you guys today so we could see what's in the box. All right, so let's get this thing open. Let me take the plastic off. All right. Ah, greatness awaits. That's that's the PlayStation slogan. You guys know what that means. All right, so let's move the box over to the side and open this. Oh, okay, that was simple. That's what's in the box. Looks pretty standard. All right, let's go ahead and try to pull these out. Okay, so you got the gold. Very beautiful color. I like the PlayStation that actually goes with these headphones. Uh, they actually had one or two of them at the GameStop by my house. And I was considering maybe buying one, but I'm going to hold out for the, the PlayStation Neo. So these are the headphones. Uh, and let me see, what do you have here? You got volume control, uh, VSS, I don't know what that is, a mute button. You got a PlayStation USB micro, a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack. Standard buttons. Now I'm trying to see where this thing actually pulls because you know I got a big head. I did break two headphones. Okay, so it folds. I'm guessing this is for uh, easy storage, but I'm still trying to see exactly how you pull these open. Um, um, oh, okay. So the do both of them move? Hmm. Oh, yeah, they do. Okay, so the actual earbuds actually slide themselves, which is actually pretty cool. I like that. Um, let me see how comfortable they are. This does not have an external microphone. It has an off button, uh, a one and a two as well. So I'm guessing that's the volume. A sound and a chat button, which seems pretty straightforward. And uh, let's see. Ooh. Now that's sexy. All right, so I know that this thing has a USB dongle. And it's not in here, so I got gypped. Okay, let me see. Please lift tray for accessories. When all else fails, look. All right, so you got a black box. And uh, this is the box. What's in the box? All right, so we've got a USB micro here for charging. You've got a 3.5 millimeter adapter. Now this is for the PlayStation Vita, which I do own, so I might use these. You see, here is the USB dongle, which is very pretty. I do like that. Um, you got the wireless stereo headset, I guess the information booklet, and uh, the quick start guide for the uh, headphones. So guys, expect a review on these sometime in the near future. I'm really happy I got these. I'm even considering grabbing two of the uh, Uncharted 4 Thieves End controllers. I do like this color. It's something uh, kind of unique and it's kind of attractive in my, in my own opinion. You guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, if you ever tried the PlayStation Gold headphones, if you have, let me know what you think of them below. Hopefully they last longer than the Turtle Beach because these $100 headphones or just flying off the shelf and breaking off my uh, head. I'm the Beastly Gamer, and I'll see you guys next time. Put some respect on it.